good evening children welcome to the online classes i am aishwarya this video is for class 2 subject general science chapter natural surrounding and machines part 2 in the previous class you all learned about the natural surroundings what uh, earth is made of that is you learnt about forest woodlands meadows grasslands deserts mountains and hills rivers lakes and ponds seas and ocean you learned in detail about what these land forms are land forms and water forms are now in this video you are going to learn uh, man made things man made things are the things that are made by man made by man means it is not naturally occurring not naturally occurring means uh, it is made by man uh, like the table or the phone that you are holding or your laptops your aquariums your tvs anything that is that is in your house is made by man natural things means it is made by nature that much you have understood so in this um, video you are going to learn about what are the different man made things now the sewing machine is one example of a man made thing a gun and a drilling machine these are all a good examples of man made things that are used in our life now we are going to see what are machines machine is an object that makes our work easy when they allow us to do more work using less force or energy now when you are doing something if you are uh, now now if you are uh, if you are having an aquarium in your house and you are going to catch a fish it becomes difficult for you to catch a fish in your bare hand and when you use a simple net that is a is kind of a machine that is kind of a simple machine that you will use it becomes easier to catch the fish like that there are so many other things which help us make life better or use less energy now in this chapter you are going to learn about two different types of machines that is simple machine and compound machine simple machine and compound machine now here the new word is compound c o m p o u n d compound machine and simple machine in the further slides you are going to learn about the simple machines and compound machines now first we are going to see what are simple machines simple machines means machine that have only one part only one part like when you are using the net in the aquarium it only has one part examples that are given is inclined planes lever pulley wheel axe wedge screw gears etc all these things are simple machines now in the next slide you are going to see now first we will see what is a inclined plane as you can see that man is using an inclined plane to go up the place it is easier to push it up than to carry it up okay so this inclined planes help them to make the work easier next is pulley as you can see here this circular green thing it is called the pulley it is easier to pull 10 kg like if when you apply force here when you pull this uh, rope this 10 kg will come up now it is easier in this way rather than carrying 10 kg with your bare hand next is 
a wheel and axle a wheel and axle this is uh, uh, used easily now here you can see a wheel uh, one second here in the inclined plane you can see a wheel and how it is easy, helping that man to push the goods on the truck next is wedge as you can see here when you have to break this if this is a wooden car uh, using this wedge you just have to hammer it and it will break open that is the simple usage of a wedge w e d g e wedge next is screw we all know screws are used extensively in our daily life in our phones that you are using every day to watch videos or anything uh, do have small very small screws inside and screws are very very helpful to hold two different things next is gears gears are also one of the example for simple machine and it can be used in our everyday life so this are the ex these are the examples for um, simple machine that is the inclined plane the uh, pulley the uh, wheel and axle the wedge the screw and the gears next you are going to learn about compound machines Com compound machine means when you use two or more simple machines to do the work when you use two or more simple machines to do the work is called compound machine for example now everybody in your house i'm sure you all have a cycle you, or otherwise you have at least seen a cycle now in the cycle you can see there are lot of small simple machines which make this a compound machine you can see two wheels here right these two are the uh, singly they are simple machine other together they become the compound machine here you can see the uh, ax you uh, here you can see the axle then you can see the chain here now i'm sure you all i might have seen the chain now these are the the gears the screw the wheel axle chain and pulley etc are the different simple machines that are used in a cycle which makes the cycle a compound machine this is the simple way to understand the difference between a simple machine and a compound machine the example for simple machine is inclined plane and pulleys uh, example for compound machines can be a cycle or a phone that you are using every day now in this whole chapter you learned about natural surroundings and uh, machines in natural surroundings you learned about um, the land forms like forest and woodland meadows and grasslands deserts mountains and hills then in water forms you learned about rivers lakes and ponds seas and ocean and etc then you learned about man made things and how the man made things make our life simple the in the man made things you learned about what are machines and you learned about simple machines and compound machines the important words for this lessons are midow n e a m e a d o w midows it is nothing but small grasslands where we graze the cattle compound machine compound machine is a machine which is a combination of two or more simple machines c o m p o u n d m a c h i n e compound machine woodland w o d l a n d woodland the area with a dense growth of tree surrounding s u r r o u n d i n g s surroundings natural and man made things objects make our surrounding inclined i n c l i n e d inclined p u l l e y pulley these are the most important words that you need to keep in your mind stay home stay safe and take care of yourselves and keep learning children thank you very much